All right, guys, it's Wednesday, so there's three new superstars available as Megas. Today are Brock Lesnar, Big Cass, and Rusev. So it's a pretty great day, depending on your roster. Let's go see them. So apart from these three, we have the regular guys also available as two stars. Let's check the main three. First off, Brock Lesnar. If you watch my channel, you've seen me use him plenty. He's got the Brock Lock, the Alabama Slam, the German Suplex, the Suplex City, the Back Body Drop. Trainer at 5,000, his Blast Gems do 35% more damage. He has links with Raw and Modern Era and two sets of gear. And I do own the second set of gear. Now, if we check his max stats, I'm actually not going to show it from my guy, but I'm going to show it from the champion's guide, mainly because I do have the trainers on him, but the trainers are not maxed. And I want to show you what the max stats are. Currently as silver, as that's how you can get him as silver. Uh, the, there's two sets of uh, skills you can use with him. The normal set is when you use Rusev and King Barrett as trainers. Rusev to have uh, three more blast gems when you create them, and Barrett to destroy five more reds when you use the yellow skill. And that that skill set is great when you have Alabama Slam, German Suplex, and Suplex City. And you can even switch the Alabama Slam for the back body drop. One of Either one of the blacks is going to be fine. You're barely ever going to use it anyway. Just make sure that the red you use is not the finisher, but the suplex city indeed, because the German suplex and suplex city are going to be the two moves you use. So for this set here, I've put in the Alabama Slam, since it's more commonly used. It de it'll deals 17k damage and makes five random reds into blast gem. The German suplex deals 3k damage and destroy eight random red gems. And the Suplex City deals almost 10k damage and choose 5 gems to make into Blast Gem. That's basically what blows up the whole board. Very good skill set. Another option is to, instead of having Rusev and Barrett as trainer, if, for example, if you have a better uh, powerhouse like, let's say, Big Cass, you'll have Rusev on him, so you won't be able to use Rusev here. You can use, instead of Rusev, Enzo to feed his German suplex so that it starts faster. In this case, make sure that your black is indeed Alabama Slam and not back body drop though, because you might need those extra blast gems on the board. That's about it for Brock. Definitely a great powerhouse. He's not the best one. He's probably ranked third or fourth, something around that. Big Acid is definitely better, but still pretty damn good. He's just a little slower than Big Cass is, because Big Cass is damn fast. That's what we're going to check now. Big Cass. He is a damn beast. I just got mine to gold just this week. Not leveled fully. Neither are the trainers, unfortunately. So we'll still do it the same way. His moves are East River Crossing, Spinning Side Slam, Jumping High Knee, Fall Away Slam, and Big Boot. Trainer skill at 5,000 is received 30% less damage from Blue Gems. He has link with Enzo Big Cass, Raw and Modern Era, and he also has two gear sets. Now, if we check his max skills at 3 star silver, because you also can get him as a silver this time, the best skills to use are red, black, black. The trainers I have on him are Bray Wyatt to start with four uh, black move points. And Rusev to have three more Blast Gem at 5,000 as well. So that would end up dealing finisher 13k damage plus 1100 bonus damage for every red gems on the board. Spinning side slam 17k damage and make five random blues into red gems. And a big boot is almost 12k damage and choose five gems to make into a Blast Gem. This, my friends, are five gems, five Blast Gems on the second turn if you got a, a black match on the first turn that is very damn quick and powerful he is a beast he's the best powerhouse in the game you won't regret getting big cast that's for sure third guy you can guy is the bulgarian brute rusev as a character to play with he's really not that great he's okay 
but not that great. But he is absolutely required for any of the Blast Gem powerhouses, including, as we just saw, Brock Lesnar and Big Cass. You absolutely need him as a trainer. His skills are the jumping sidekick, the fallaway slam, the back suplex, the running hip press, and the superplex. Trainer skills, as we saw at 5,000, moves that generate Blast Gem will create three more Blast Gem. He has links with Russian, League of Nations, SmackDown, and Modern Era, and he also has two, two gear sets. If we check his skills, Rusev at 3 star silver as well. His best trainers are not that great, actually. It's Goldust and Kevin Owens, both boosting 45% more uh, green damage. Uh, the commonly used set is uh, basically green, red, green, without using his finisher. Uh, mainly because the other red does a little more damage, but if you want to be sure, you can always use the finisher instead of the hip press. Personally, I kind of like to have the finisher better just because if you're stuck and you have done all the damage, you don't really have any pin output. But uh, I wouldn't recommend using Rusev anyway. But if you use the finisher, it's 14.7k damage plus 30,000 for every Blast Gems. If you don't, instead the running hip press is going to be 16k damage and you can make two random color turn into blast gem obviously the chance for you to have a random color turn is pretty unlikely unless you specifically picked him for a fight like that but the two greens you'll be using are the foul away slam that deals 31k damage and choose two gems to make into blast gems and the superplex that deals 21k damage and make five random blues into reds those are the moves for rusev as i said he is required for training purposes mainly. So, not too shabby of a pull. Actually, pretty good pull if you have to do one. Also, a bonus item this time. You don't only have the 100k coins. You also have 10 uh, blast, uh, whatever it's called, marching orders to add one blast gem to the board. Nice little perk. They're fun to use. So, that's it. Hopefully, you guys got some good info here if you're not already a sub on my channel make sure you do so to be kept away when i post new stuff if you have comment leave them and if you like the video leave a like see ya